And speaking of Donald Trump's visit to Japan, the U.S. president is on a four-day state visit to Japan where he mentioned progress with North Korea, trade tensions with Japan, F-35 fighter jets and, well, space exploration too. Here's a report on his visit. Trump made an unexpected announcement on his third day in Japan. We'll be going to the moon. We'll be going to Mars very soon. There is nothing more important right now than space. In another major announcement, Trump said that Japan would buy more than 100 F-35 fighter jets from the U.S. It's intent to purchase 105 brand new F-35 stealth aircraft. Stealth because the fact is you can't see them. This purchase would give Japan the largest F-35 fleet of any U.S. ally. India and the Indo-Pacific figured in their discussions too. With the countries concerned like Australia, India, ASEAN, UK and France, uh, we will fortify the cooperation toward the realization of a free and open Indo-Pacific. We will enhance and expand our efforts. We agreed on that. Trump is on a four-day state visit to Japan. His visit comes at a time when trade imbalance is an irritant in US-Japan ties. Trump has been unhappy with Japan's large trade surplus and has been considering high tariffs on Japanese cars. Earlier in the day, Trump met Japan's new emperor, Naruhito. He became the first foreign leader to be received by the emperor since Naruhito inherited the throne earlier this month. Trump has another first to his credit. As sumo grand champion, I hereby award you the United States President's Cup. On Sunday, he became the first U.S. president to watch sumo in Japan. He also made time for golf. North Korea, China and Iran also came up for discussion. Trump said that he was in no rush to reach a peace deal with North Korea. As far as China is concerned, uh, they were going to make a deal. I think they probably wish they made the deal. In a similar vein, Trump said that Washington was not yet ready to make a trade deal with Beijing, although he hoped that it will happen in the future. On Iran, Abe said that Japan was willing to do all it can to avoid an armed conflict in West Asia. For his part, Trump said that he was not looking for regime change in Iran. What he was looking for, though, is no Iranian nuclear weapon. Bureau report, Vion, World is One.